The sister of a man found dismembered in July in his Lower East Side apartment is speaking out for the first time. She explains the horrors she and her family have been going through ever since his death. But I'll never be able to hug the game again. Heartbroken, still trying to comprehend the loss of her 33-year-old brother, Fahim Saleh. Ruby Saleh posted this video tribute on the one-month anniversary of his death. My family and I are in such shock and debilitating pain. Our beautiful boy was taken from us. And right now, it doesn't feel like life can ever be joyful again. Last month, when a cousin hadn't heard from Saleh, she went to his Lower East Side luxury condo on East Houston and discovered his body in the living room, his head, arms, and legs amputated. Sources tell CBS2 his assistant, 21-year-old Tyrese Haspel, was embezzling money from the scooter for hire company Saleh founded. Haspel promised to pay him back $100,000, but investigators believe Haspel killed him instead. He is now charged with second-degree murder. We will also dedicate ourselves to ensure that Fahim gets justice. My brother's death was a crime of the most cruel and heinous nature. Ruby Saleh describes her brother as a self-taught entrepreneur who would travel across the globe to surprise his family for special occasions, loved pranks and making garlic mashed potatoes at Thanksgiving. If you're someone's sister, the next time you see your brother, please hug him as tightly as you can. The Saleh family says they are now doing everything in their power to keep Fahim's memory alive and vision ongoing. And Haspel pleaded not guilty in July and is being held without bail. And you can see Ruby Saleh's full tribute video on our website, cbsnewyork.com.